hi guys and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel um so as you can see here this is washi tape this is as far as i can tell i looked in all different places my entire collection of washi tape and something i've been wanting to do for a while is actually go through it and declutter and you know rehome some of this washi to people who may actually use it <laughs> rather than having it just sit in a drawer there's quite a few washi in here that I can look at and say, I haven't used that in three years. And the likelihood of me wanting to use that again is extremely low. Plus, we want to keep room open for new washi that we actually love and are going to use. So today, I am going to walk you through, um, just kind of, you know, going through. I'm going to organize these into piles. So we're going to have definitely keep, um, you know, donate and then maybe sell um, if there's any that I feel are like highly sought after or something, I guess. Um, but I don't, I don't think that's going to be the case. I'm probably just going to rehome most of this. Um, but yeah, let's just get right into it. I'm just going to start one drawer at a time. So we're going to start with this drawer. All right. So we're just going to pull out one row at a time here and look at each individual roll and decide Hey, do I even love this? Because I'm at the point where if I don't love it, I don't want to keep it. Like this. I haven't used this in many years. I, as you can see, I did use a decent amount of it. Um, but like, I'm, I'm just kind of, I'm over it. I've, I've had it for a long time. So this will be a donate. This is a definitely keep. I use this all the time. Not just during spooky season, but just, I love it. Um, so that's definitely a keep. So we're going to put that in the keep pile. This is going to be giveaway and keep. This washi I was really disappointed with. Um, it's really pretty, but I got it from Michael's this year. Um, I bought it online and it just doesn't stick down like at all. It has almost no adhesive on it. So um, I'm sure there are people who would like use a tape runner and, and make it stay down. But like, I'm just not... This one I actually didn't even use. So let's see if this one, I assume it's the same thing. It's not very sticky. Like at all. So yeah, I, I'm just not... I almost, I don't even want to donate these because they... I mean, they just don't work. So these will probably be... Um, let's make a separate pile for these that we... The I'm not sure pile. Because <laughs> I just don't know. This one, you know, I pulled this out during spooky season and just when I look at it, it's kind of like really low quality. It's very see-through. You can kind of see like the blacks. I don't know. <clears throat> this was one of the first washi I ever bought. Um, I've had it a very long time, but since I have this white one and I have a couple new Honeybee Shop um, spiderweb washi coming in, I think I'm going to donate this one. It's time to... Time to hang that one up. This one, I don't believe I used it at all this year, but I like it. That now, see, this one looks a lot better. It's a lot more like opaque. Um, yeah, nothing wrong with a little jack lantern. Definitely gonna keep keep that one. This one is very pretty, but it's just one of those ones that I've had for a very long time. I have no clue where it's even from, if it's Happy Planner, if it's Recollections, if I have no idea. But it's very pretty. I just, I'm kind of over it. So this will be Donate. This, I'm pretty sure is a Happy Planner washi. It's just a red washi with some little squiggles. When I need a red washi, I, I always like pull this one out and then I'm like, eh, I don't really like it. So I think that tells you that that is Donate. This is a little like orange scallop. This is one of those tiny washi. Um, I kind of mixed on this. I don't love it. I don't love it. And that should probably tell you. We'll donate it. This is from that same collection with these that it just does not stick like at all. Um... <laughs> So unfortunately, these are probably gonna have to go in the trash. I really, I really don't want to do that. It's very wasteful, but I just don't. They don't work. This one I love and I've had for so long. 
I mean, it's it's freaking bats. <laughs> it's freaking bats. It's orange and it's bats and it's got stars and uh, you can't go wrong. I love that one. Keep. Definitely keep. This is a thin little rainbow washi. I'll keep this because when I want to do a rainbow spread, I pretty much always reach for this. Um, I don't have a lot of rainbow washi. This might actually be the only one that has like all the colors in it. So we'll keep that one. This is a honeybee washi that um, I got very recently in a babe box and I think it's very pretty. Um, it's not 100% my vibe all the time, which I said when I did my social media planner. I'll link that video. I did it in the blush baby theme, which is very beautiful. Um, but this, like, this is more my everyday kind of vibe. <laughs> But there are times when I'm feeling really girly and I want it to be very pretty and like dainty and I'll definitely reach for that. So I'm keeping both of those. Oh God, this is an all time favorite. I remember when I saw this, you know those like bins at Michael's when you're walking to the checkout and you're like, all right, I'm done. I'm not buying anything else. And then they have a bin and it's like three for a dollar washi. And you're like, <sighs> that's how I ended up with this. And I bought three of, of this. Um, I know that I used one of them completely up and then I have, yeah, I have another one here in the drawer. Um, I just, I, I love it. It's just, I mean, there's really not, really not much else to say about it. Um, I mean, look at it. So definitely keep love this one. I've been kind of hoarding it this year. <clears throat> it says spooks and spells and thrills and chills. And it's got, uh, silver foil, which is my personal favorite, and I just, well, silver and hollow are my favorite. <sighs> Unfortunately, this is from that same collection. They, none of them stick um, at, at all, so yeah. This is, I have no clue where this came from or how I ended up with it, but it's an orange washi with like a pointed kind of Again, it's not very opaque, and it's just not really, I'm not really into it, so I'm going to donate that one. Pull out these. I can already tell there's a few in here that I no longer want. I've had them for so long, and I'm just over it. All right. Eh. This one's really pretty. Um, I don't reach for it a ton, but when I want butterflies, I mean, it's just... It's pretty. I love butterflies, always have, and um, it's just really good for like spring, and I use a lot in memory keeping, so I'm going to hold on to that one. This one, I don't even know that I've ever used it. I believe this came in a, I think this is Happy Planner, and I think it came in a pack with a bunch of other washi that I liked, and this one isn't really, I don't know. I think I'm going to, I'm going to give this away. This one says it's always impossible. Or it always <laughs> it's always impossible. It always seems impossible until it's done. Um, I've had this for an incredibly long time, and I've used it. I've kind of it's just one of those things like I've I've seen it for so long. I'm just kind of over it. So that one I will be getting rid of. This one, I I don't know. I'm just not crazy about this color. This like salmony color with the gold. I mean, it's, it's fine. It's pretty. It's just not something I ever reach for as far as color. I just, yeah, I'm going to get rid of that one. This one I like. I am a sucker for polka dots and I love green. So if I ever have a green, this again reminds me of, it's very springy. So, um, yeah, I will definitely be keeping that one. This is another honeybee shop. This is the hollow version, which is my favorite. I mean, I'm always gonna like hollow and silver better than gold. That's just how I am, but yeah, I'm gonna keep that one. And this is the hollow one that goes along with it. Oh my God, yeah. This is a Happy Planner washi that is from the, this came with, it was either my planner or my mom's planner at the time. It was a teacher planner and it's just yellow with little glasses and I just think it's cute. So gonna keep I've definitely I've used quite a bit of it. I'm gonna work through the rest of that. This is a duplicate. This is the same as 
this one and yeah, gonna donate that one as well. This is very similar to that other striped one, to this one. Uh, same kind of color story and I'm just not really into it. Oh gosh, I love this one. This is the Shine Sticker Studio washi and it's just got little planner babes and the different skin tones. I, I love it. So yeah, that's not even a question. Keeping. Oh my god, Simply Gilded. So Simply Gilded washi, although I only have like three or four rolls here and then I have uh, I think two, maybe three rolls on the way from Simply Gilded, it's my favorite washi as far as quality. Um, as far as designs, they have a lot of really beautiful designs. They're not all, like, I'm not super into all the bows. Like, when I first saw Simply Gilded, it was everybody had the bows, and they're cute, but I don't want, like, 60 rolls with bows on it. That's just not me. However, when I started looking at their other washi, like this one with the little paw prints, yeah. Um, and I just think the quality is top-notch. It sticks, and it stays down. <laughs> Um, but it's not too sticky when you like need to peel it up. It's just really, it's just good quality and I love it. So that's my Simply Gilded tangent. I love this washi. This is actually scented. Um, so <laughs> it's scratch and sniff. I wish you could smell it. It smells like vanilla. And I use this pretty much for every birthday spread ever because it has little sprinkles and it smells like vanilla. So keep. God, this is an old one. Whew. Yeah, and I never reach for it. So, donate. This is an old one as well that I think is very beautiful. It is really pretty. It's got roses. It's, you know, pink and purple and black. And it's very beautiful. I don't reach for it a ton, but I'm going to keep it for now. Um, cause I think I might in the future. It's just one of those I kind of forget that I have and it just kind of sits in there. It's not something I'm going to use, you know, regularly, but I think it is very pretty and will get some use. If I could put it back on the roll straight, that would be awesome. There we go. <laughs> and this might be the most basic washi of all time. It's just, per I don't even know where this came from. It's just purple. Um, but it's not... It's not good quality. See how it's not very opaque and it just looks very, this kind of looks like a recollections, uh, something out of that bin. I'm not, yeah, get rid of that one. I'm, I want to be honest with you guys. You see this, right? <sighs> All right. I'm, I'm just, I'm going to be, I'm going to be honest. So this is Honey Bee Shop Washi. This it doesn't stick down. It it doesn't. Now it does stick to the page for a while, but then like the the edge starts to peel up. Um, and the biggest gripe I have with it is that when it sits in your drawer, you see like I just pulled it out of the drawer and it was like that. It's absolutely gorgeous, and that's why I buy it. Um, but I do have to like tape it down, and it's kind of ridiculous. So just wanted to point that out. But I'm keeping them because they're beautiful. <laughs> Okay, this is another Shine Sticker Studio washi. It says Planner Girl with a little hair in a bun. Very cute. Definitely keeping. This is from that same Honey Bee Shop collection. I, yeah, it's really beautiful. Just doesn't want to stick down. This was the uh, Honey Bee Shop and Cookie Sticker Co. collab. Same thing. Um, doesn't want to stick down. It's very annoying for storage and for usage. Um, it's very pretty, but I'm not going to lie. I kind of regret buying this one because the, I mean, it's very pretty again, but the, the pattern that like kind of tie dye is pretty, but it's just not really me. It's not something I reach for. Now, like this with like the gradient, I really like. Um, but this kind of like tie dye pattern, I'm just not a hundred percent like crazy about it. So it's beautiful. It really is. But I just feel like I'm not going to get the use out of it and somebody else would really enjoy it. So I'm either going to donate or sell this more to come, but I'm going to put that in 
this pile. And this goes with the other, oh my God. I did, yeah, I really like that one. This is one of my favorite in my collection. This is from Simply Gilded. And this was actually um, one of the first I ever bought from them. Well, it was in my first Simply Gilded order ever, which I did a video of, I will link to that. But like, look at it. I mean, yeah. What more can I say? <laughs> this also was in my first Simply Gilded order. It has little cats on it. And I mean, are you kidding? Yeah. I, I need to go off on a little side tangent real quick and just speak about these scotch washi tapes. These are underrated. Um, you can get these at Walmart. They're very inexpensive. Um, they run sales. And again, they're by scotch, like scotch tape. And it's scotch, you can see it's scotch expressions and it is washi tape. It's very hard for me to get that in the frame. There you go, washi tape. Um, so yes, it is actual washi tape and that's what it's meant for. And it just works really well. It's great quality. It's really pretty. These hollow ones are everything. I just, I love them. And I think they're very, like nobody talks about Scotch washi. Um, this one, I've almost used the entire roll. Black glitter, I love it. This one is, oh my god, so pretty. And this hot pink one, like, this is like so like summertime to me. So yeah, Scotch washi tape. If you ever see it in Walmart, highly recommend picking it up. This is, I think, from Recollections. I think this was one of those Michael's bin, uh, checkout bin washies that I picked up. I love green. I love polka dots. And I do use this one. Not super often, but I love it. So definitely keeping that. This is, weirdly enough, one of my favorite washi tapes, and I rebought it. I used the entire roll of it and I rebought it. And it is from Happy Planner, and it is uh, very simple. It's just pink and white stripes. But just the way that it looks, I don't know. There's something about it that I really enjoy. It's one of my favorite washi. This is also from Shine Sticker Studio. Um, just little pencils, super cute. This is from Happy Planner as well. And it's just little, not polka dots, but just kind of like a white and black dot pattern. And then, oh my God. I'm a sucker for moths, like just moth anything and butterflies and just all that, like, look. Now this is a gold foil that I really enjoy. Um, is this gold or rose gold? I think this is gold. Yeah, it's gold. Um, it's very beautiful and it, again, not something I'm gonna reach for every day, but oh my God, definitely one of my favorite in my collection. All right, so that is the first drawer done. So we have decluttered a decent amount here. So I'm going to, before I start putting them back in the drawers, I'm going to do the rest and then decide how I kind of want to group them because um, that just seems to make more sense. All right. This one I can tell there's a lot I'm going to get rid of. Um, this one's okay. I mean, it has like little pink dots. Like it's, it's fine. I just, I don't reach for it. Definitely going to donate. Pass that one along. Going to pass this along too. I thought I liked it, but I'm, eh, I'm not crazy about it. Going to donate that. Uh, this is a little typewriters and I love it. Definitely going to keep. I'm not doing these in any order now. <laughs> um, this says, hey, cupcake, treat yourself. And this is from, it came in a pack with that one that I showed you that is scented. Where is 
And of course now I can't find it. Where is it? Oh. Yeah, so these came together. Um, I don't think this one is scented. Oh, it is! That one's scented too. So yeah, these are pretty much the birthday washi. I thought I was going to like this one, but I don't. And I never, I don't think I've used it once, so. D-Stash. Um, these are little cupcakes and like muffins. Um, they're okay. Uh, I'll D-Stash that one. Teach, Love, Inspire. Um, I do really like this one. Yeah, I'm going to keep that one. This one, I don't know. I don't think I like it. I tried to use it not too long ago, and then I was like, I don't like it. Yeah, see, it's it's that low quality kind of like, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just not, I'm not crazy about it. This is a happy planner washi as well. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to declutter that one. These like coppery colors, I just feel like I never, ever, ever use. I mean, it's pretty. It's just not some, it's, I just, I never, I don't think I've ever used these. So we're going to declutter. Butterflies, like I said before, I do, I'm a sucker for butterflies. I do love it. And it's black and white, goes with anything. Going to keep. Never have reached for this ever. Donate. <laughs> never have reached for this. Or this, even though it's pretty. Or this. Declutter. All right, doing good, doing good. All right, these are Dollar Tree washi, and I I do like this one. Like if you ever just want like little stripes, so I'm gonna keep that one. This has little bumblebees on it. Um, very cute. Might see if my mom wants that. She really likes bumblebees, but I just don't really use it. And this says wish with a unicorn and um yeah. These little baby skinny washi, I just feel like they have their place. I just feel like I don't reach for these ones. And like I always pull out the drawers and I look and I'm like, eh. And these are all happy planner. And I remember when I bought these. <clears throat> it was it was after the back to school thing uh in 2019 I believe and they were on like deep discount and these all like came in a pack together and I was like well you know I just kind of like freaked over it and just bought it without even looking at them but I feel like most of these I don't use um I do I do like these little rainbow hearts because like I said before with that one rainbow washi, um, if I want to do a rainbow spread, I don't have a lot. And I do think that's very cute. So I will keep that one. These, I'm just not, I'm just not crazy about them. Even the butterfly one, I'm just not crazy about. So I would like to declutter those. These as well, I've never used. Mm, yeah. These are very pretty. I remember buying them. They're from Michael's or Recollections. And they came in a pack. Oh, I really like that one. It's just pink. I, I do like that one. Um, They're like watercolor, kind of. They're very pretty, but I've had them for a long time. And I'm just kind of like, kind of over it. So I'm going to de-stash those. Never use these. And uh, yeah. These are Disney washi from... Dollar Tree <laughs> and I bought them for a specific reason when I um when I went to Disney a couple years ago and I was doing my memory keeping I wanted Disney washi and I happened to find them at Dollar Tree but I'm gonna see if my friend Queen uh, would like these because she is um a Disney freak and I think she would like these she might already have them but she would get way more use than I would so Putting that in the pile for seeing if Queen would like them. This, this is 
okay. I just, I'm not crazy about like how you have like the big black stripe and then these are, I don't know. There's some, I just, I never reach for it. Declutter. Okay. These are old. I've had, man, I've had these for a long time. Very beautiful, but they have an issue with sticking. And again, I've had them for so long that I just, I never reach for them and I'm not, yeah, declutter. This was a Dollar Tree washi. Declutter. Another Dollar Tree washi. This one is like really not. Oh. I, yeah, declutter. This is a Dollar Tree washi and it has little diamonds on it. This was pretty much when I had like no washi tape and I just was desperate to like build my collection and I was at Dollar Tree and it was there. I don't think I've used that one time. These are from Cookie Sticker Co. And these are absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah. Keeping both of those. Oh my god. So these are Honey Bee Shop. And these are two of my favorite in my collection. <laughs> it's a skeleton middle finger and a skeleton rock on. And it's just... Yeah. Love these. Um, again, I, I'm just being honest with you guys. The Honey Bee Washi, um, I do find, has some issues sticking to the roll and, like, staying down. And that is kind of frustrating. Um, but this is, these, I mean, it's still two of my favorites in my collection. <coughs> Woo, need a sip of coffee. Speaking of favorites in my collection, holy crap. So the, you can't even tell what it is when it's like this. I just got these very recently. <clears throat> these were the extras from the Halloween advent calendar, the blackout. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I'm, I am obsessed. It's clear washi and it's black bat bows and stars. And I, oh my God, I wish I had like 20 of them. This is the same thing, just thicker. And yeah. All right, another drawer down and one more drawer to go. Oh, there's a lot to declutter in this one. I can already tell. So let's just go ahead and uh, get all these little, these little Dollar Tree ones out. No, no. No, 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 <laughs> no. I am going to keep these black ones because I, I've i used them to, like, cover up um, mistakes. Like, kind of like whiteout, but blackout. Yeah, and it's pretty, like, it's decent. I'm going to keep the two little black ones because I feel like I will use those. No. No, no. Yes, this is another. This one is like on its last. <laughs> this is like almost empty. Um, yeah, this is that pink and white happy planner washi. Definitely keeping. No. Okay, these are all declutter. I think these are all declutter. I don't think I've used any of these in several years. Um, well, I lied. This purple, this purple one with the little dots, I really like. And this one. This, yeah, it has like gray stripes on it. Very pretty. Yeah, other than that, just kind of over it. Had them for a long time. This is a backup, like I said, of that one of my favorite skeleton washies. Um, this is navy. I don't really reach for navy anything, so yeah. This I really like. Um, I've almost used the entire thing, but it's just black and white stripes. Purple. Um, I don't even know what you would call this pattern, but I like it. Purple scallop. Pretty much a lot of the purples, I'm, yeah. 
This is yellow and white polka dots. You can tell. I never reach for that. Now this green one, this like minty green with the stripes, I do really like. I'm going to keep that. Not crazy about that one. Declutter. This has succulents on it. Love it. Keeping it. I love, this is like the only one that I have. This is like the only one I had that's white with black dots. Like I just, I don't know. It's very simple. Um, this purple stripe one I do like. This one I like, I just never use it. Be mainly because the the arrows on it are blue instead of black. And like I said, I just, anything that's kind of like navy is just not, not my jam. This came in a pack with some other Halloween washi and I'm not crazy about it. It's a little uh, witch skirts and feet. I've had it for a while and never reach for it. This one has the sticking issue. It's very pretty, but it doesn't want to stick. I'm going to get rid of that one. Love this candy cane one, keeping that. Love this green with little white dots. Mm, I never reach for this one. Fall, love that one. This one is just really similar, but like poor quality than that other jack-o'-lantern one I have. I'm just not, oh God, yeah, look, it doesn't even wanna, it just ripped. Yeah, it's just not very good quality. D stash. Almost done. Oh, I'm so happy with my progress. I think I'm getting rid of more than I'm keeping. Yay. Cause you know what that means. More room for more washi. Oh, this is the third one. I thought it was out. All right, so this is just really cute. I mean, I'm a photographer, love the cameras. Yeah, I do use that one quite a bit. This is black with little pink, white, and green. Dancing Skeletons. I love it. This is a backup of that other <laughs> white spiderweb washi. I just, it's really pretty. Yeah. This is really pretty. It's just like this really pretty like Victorian Halloween pattern. It has like skulls and little bats and it's like hollow. It's very pretty. Definitely keeping. This is the other scotch washi. Love it. This is a very old Happy Planner, like, winter and Christmas washi. I used this very recently. I think it's very cute. I'm going to use that one up. Little Christmas trees. I do use that one as well. This one I'm really, like, torn about because I love the little ghosts, but the hollow on it is, like, messed up. As you can see, it's, like, yeah, I'm... Um, I'm going to declutter that one. This is one of my favorites, and I forgot about it. I forgot to use it this year uh, during Halloween, but I'll probably use it just some other time because, you know, I'm weird. But it has a crow, skeleton hand, and a really pretty bat. Like, And it's this, like, mauve -y color. It, I love it. Orange with black bats. Do we even need to ask? Yes, we're keeping it. This is the final backup of that vertical skeleton washi <laughs> and then the last of the skinny happy planner washi and i don't think i want actually i want this one because this is like reminds me of like candy cane these three yeah okay so now it's time to put the ones we're keeping back in the drawers Now, how am I going to go about organizing these? Well, in my head, what makes sense is doing it by, like, company. Like, so for this, these are scotch. I want to put all the scotch ones together because I just, 
makes sense in my head. It's just finding the other ones in this pile that's going to be... There's one. Now I do have a craft cart as well and on the front I have this little thing that where you can hang stuff on it and I do hang my like most frequently used washi on that so I'll do that later. But for now I'm just going to put everything in the drawer. Here's the pink one. I want to kind of do it by size just because it looks a little better in the drawer. This is all going to a new home. How great is that? Um, it feels good to get rid of stuff that I don't really want because going into the new year, I want to, you know, I just want to have things I love and stuff I don't love. I don't, I don't want it. You know, I'm not just going to keep it because I used to have this mindset of like, oh, three years ago, I spent money on this, so I can't get rid of it now. And it's like, no, if you don't love it, somebody else would use it and really, you know, enjoy it. So that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I would love to see your washi collections. Please, you know, tag me on Instagram at planning with cast. Comment below. Let me know um, how you organize your washi, you know, kind of what your favorite washi is. Um, if you have like a favorite brand, if you have a favorite type or just anything i would love to know but thank you guys so much for watching be sure to give this a thumbs up if you haven't and i will see you guys next time